Yes, a lot has happened overnight as the Russian military advances farther into Ukraine. Let's get you caught up on the very latest. Last night, a top Pentagon official told lawmakers in the U.S. that Russian forces were about 20 miles from the Ukrainian capital of Kyiv. In a video message around 6.40 Eastern time last night, Ukrainian President Zelensky said 137 soldiers had been killed, more than 300 others injured in the fight. Then around 12.23 this morning, an apartment building was hit by debris after an aircraft was reportedly shot down in Kyiv. You can see the burned outside of the building there. Two hours later, the Ukrainian Interior Ministry said that Ukrainian forces were blowing up bridges to try and slow down Russian forces advancing on the capital. And just before three this morning, the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense issued this message asking citizens to make and use Molotov cocktails against the Russian military. And shortly after 4 a.m., a warning from Ukraine that Russian forces are using disguises to enter the country. NBC News has not been able to verify these reports. And also this morning, NBC News foreign correspondent Matt Bradley reported a massive bombardment in central Kharkiv. Matt said it was so close he could hear car alarms going off. And citing Russia's defense ministry, the news agency TASS is reporting that Russian military has blocked Kyiv from the west. That's reported we have not yet been able to independently verify. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.